Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. In this very exciting and challenging video on radical equations, the given equation is fifth root of 5 power x plus 40 minus fifth root of 5 power x minus 40 equal to fifth root of 80. And we are going to calculate real solutions only. So let's get started by taking this minus sign into this radicate or fifth root. So I can write fifth root of 40 plus 5 power x. Then I will write plus sign. Then we can write fifth root of 40 minus 5 power x. Now RHS is fifth root of 80. Now I will consider this is substitution A and this is substitution B. So one direct equation I can write A plus B equal to fifth root of 80. Second equation I will write from substitution. So if fifth root of 40 plus 5 power x is equal to A. So I can write A power 5 will be 40 plus 5 power x. And if fifth root of 40 minus 5 power x is B, then B power 5 will be 40 minus 5 power x. Let's add both. So A power 5 plus B power 5 will be 40 plus 40, 80. And this 80, it is matching with our radicant in the RHS. So I can write our equation as A plus B equal to fifth root of a power 5 plus b power 5. Now I will consider power 5 both sides. Let me write here a plus b equal to fifth root of a power 5 plus b power 5. Raise power 5 both sides. So I will be having a plus b whole power 5, this will be equal to a power 5 plus b power 5. Now the turn of Pascal triangle binomial expansion. So I will find out coefficients for power 5 expansion. So let me write for power 2, it is 1 to 1. For power 3, 1 3 3 1. For power 4, 1 4 6 4 1. And for required power 5, 1 5 10 10 5 1. Let us expand. LHS I can write. I am taking these two all together, these two all together, these two all together. So I will be writing a power 5 plus b power 5. Multiplier 1 is over. Now 5. 5 times a power 4 b plus a b power 4. Now the turn of multiplier 10. 10 times in bracket a cube b square plus a square b cube and RHS is a power 5 plus b power 5. Now we can cancel these two. Now I will be writing 5 a b is common so in bracket a cube plus b cube 10 a square b square is common. So in bracket a plus b, RHS will be 0. Now I will divide this equation by 5. So let me write a b, a cube plus b cube plus 2 times a square b square a plus b. Let's apply a cube plus b cube formula. So a b a plus b a square plus b square minus a b plus 2 times a square b square a plus b equal to 0. Now what we have common a b and a plus b. So let's take a b a plus b common out. So in bracket we will have a square plus b square minus ab plus 2ab. 
let me write here ab a plus b in bracket i will be writing a square plus b square minus ab plus 2ab equal to 0 or i can write ab a plus b here i will be writing a square plus b square plus ab equal to 0 now a plus b cannot be 0 as this is fifth root of 80 a plus b was fifth root of 80 so it is non zero so i will be writing from here either a equal to 0 or b equal to 0 or a square plus b square plus ab equal to 0 so let us begin with this third equation then we will solve a equal to 0 and b equal to 0 so let me write here a square plus b square plus ab equal to 0 equation a square plus b square i can write a plus b whole square minus 2ab and then plus ab equal to 0 or i can write a plus b whole square minus ab equal to 0 or i can write a plus b whole square equal to ab let me write here a plus b whole square equal to ab now a plus b was equation 1 it was fifth root of 80 so i'll be writing here fifth root of 80 whole square let's apply the value of a and b a was fifth root of 40 plus 5 power x b was fifth root of 40 minus 5 power x now i will consider rhs as fifth root of 40 plus 5 power x times 40 minus 5 power x now it is a plus b times a minus b identity so we can write here fifth root of a square minus b square so 5 power x whole square now using exponential property a power b whole power c we can write a power c whole power b so we can swap these two powers so rhs i can write fifth root of 40 square minus 5 square whole power x or i can write fifth root of 40 square 5 square is 25 so left hand side we have fifth root of 80 whole square and rhs we are having fifth root of 40 square minus 25 power x let me write here fifth root of 80 whole square equal to fifth root of 40 square minus 25 power x now i will use the same property in lhs also so i will be writing fifth root of 80 square rhs is fifth root of 40 square minus 25 power x now raise both sides power 5 so i will be writing 80 square equal to 40 square minus 25 power x or 25 power x it will be equal to 40 square minus 80 square so this value is coming out negative 25 power x if it is negative then conclusion will be complex solutions 
so we can reject this solution as we are looking for real one only now two equations are left a equal to 0 and b equal to 0 so i can write a power 5 it will be also 0 b power 5 it will be also 0 now a power 5 was 40 plus 5 power x and b power 5 was 40 minus 5 power x now from first equation i can write 5 power x is equal to negative 40 again i will write complex solutions and reject it and from second equation i will write 5 power x is equal to 40 now i will take log both sides so i will be writing here log 5 power x equal to log 40 base is 10 now there are two properties which i am going to use let me write here log a power b it is equal to b log a which i will use in lhs and for rhs once i will write 40 as 8 times 5 so let me write property log ab equal to log a plus log b so our equation is log 5 power x is equal to log 40 equal to log 40 40 we can write 5 times 8 now using first property i will write x log 5 as lhs and right hand side i will be writing log 5 plus log 8 now we have to divide both sides by log 5 so let's divide log 5 log 5 log 5 so this value will be 1 here we will cancel log 5 with log 5 writing 1 so x is equal to 1 plus log 8 over log 5 or we can write x is equal to 1 plus log 8 with base 5 as we know the property log a base c over log b base c we can write log a base b so this is our final answer and if i will use calculator then i can write x is equal to 1 plus this is log 8 so 3 log 2 over log 5 1 plus 3 times 0 0.3010 so it will become 0 0.9030 log 5 is 0 0.6990 and if i will write here then 1 plus approximate value 1.29 then I will write our final decimal answer 2.29. And this brings the end of the video friends. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care of yourself. Bye bye.